Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue with Modern Warfare 3. Whenever you launch or try to play the game, you got the error of shaders preloading which is stuck at 0% or at some other percentage. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all, in the basic step, head over to settings menu, choose windows update and if any update is pending at your end, make sure you choose the option download and install to make your operating system up to date. Secondly is just go ahead and simply launch the game and instead of playing the game, you need to go to the test range. As soon as you hit the test range, just leave to the menu and it will start to load automatically. This is a simple tip, however works for most of the users. If this failed to work out, in next step, go ahead, play the game and simply wait in the queue for multiplayer. Make sure you wait for queue in the multiplayer and as soon as you enter into the queue, go ahead and cancel. Repeat the step 4 to 5 times and this will help you fix out the issue of Modern Warfare 3 shaders preloading stuck at 0%. Now if both the methods fail to work out, let's proceed with the third step. If you are using battle.net, go ahead, click on this gear icon and choose the option show in explorer. If you are using Steam, just right click and choose the option Manage and click on Browse Local Files. You are welcome this particular screen with Call of Duty. I am using Battle.net Launcher. So from here, first of all, click on this Sort option and choose the option Type. Now under the Type, Expand and whatever applications are present with the type Application as well as Application Extension, go ahead, select each one of them. After selecting, right click and choose the option delete. Once deleted, you need to open battle.net folder and here also you need to find the same files with the application and application extension in the type file. Retail also D3D12 and here is again application extension. Right click and delete. I mean the process is pretty lengthy. Blizzard browser, type and again these are the files with the name application and application extension. Select all of them, right click, delete. No folder, again two files with the name application extension, select, right click and delete. The process is pretty lengthy and I can understand but this particular process works for many of the users. So go ahead and simply delete all the files with applications and applications extension. After deleting all the files, if you are using battle.net, click on this gear icon and choose the option scan and repair. If you are using steam, right click on steam and choose the option properties. Click on this installed files and click on the option verify integrity of game files. This will go ahead and reinstall the files that we have deleted and in turn fix out the issue of Modern Warfare 3 shader preloading stuck at 0%. However, if all the method fails, the only hope you have is to do a clean installation of the game. So whichever launcher you are using, just go ahead, click on this gear icon and choose the option uninstall. Click on the option yes uninstall. This will go ahead and completely uninstall the Call of Duty for you. Once the game is completely uninstalled, go ahead and click on the option install. It will take some time and once the game is completely installed, it will completely fix out the issue of Modern Warfare 3 shader preloading stuck at 0%. So as of now, this is all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.